So hey guys, how you going? This is my first uh, XCOM PvP match. Now I was just using a little alien and a really decked out soldier. And the opponent started first and this is my turn. I decided to go on the roof, have a look. And now it's the opponent's turn. That was obviously a mistake, because here it comes. They found my important commander unit. Pretty much my only chance of winning. And she's she's getting battered by some lasers right now. And right now I'm I'm shitting my pants, uh, and I was next to my brother, he was giving me some you know, we were both discussing what we should do and stuff. He was my tactical advice. So yes, all hope seems lost right now. I'm copying a lot of damage and she's pretty much on her last length of life. And it's two versus six still, so we're gonna go invisible and we're gonna we're gonna try and take these bastards out. Moved over there, they can't see me right now. And I discovered three of them. Now with this little fella, we just run him away. Now the what I had in mind at the moment was I was just gonna troll him. If, uh, should my commander die, but it turned out that moving him there was pretty much essential to winning the game. So one of them went missing, he, he jumped off the roof and there was only two out of three in my vision. And they're just waiting there, waiting for something to happen. It's getting crowded over here. And another one spotted, just roaming around the back alley. Now, it's time for the counter attack. I've been revealed, I got to do something, that's what I was thinking. And we just decided that we'd use some powers and just kill that motherfucker. There we go. That's all we could do, we had to hope for the best. And yeah, the little fella, he just ran into the bone, which is essential to winning the game, as we can see. And this is where the opponent screws up, he runs too close, he should have just shot, but he ran in and he got fucked up. It's that reaction shot. Now it's, now it's a bit of a comeback. We're in the offensive now, feeling pretty good. Go invisible, hop down, and we're looking for more victims. So that's dwindled two of their soldiers, so now it's four versus two. And oh, nobody's home, but there we go, we farmed one. And then the little fella, he just he's just waiting there, scouting, giving me some information. And now this little fella's gonna get a surprise. I don't know what he was thinking, he's gonna move it, but little did he know, this crazy bitch is here, and she takes a she shot and kills him. Lovely. So at this stage we're feeling pretty good, it's three of us two. And we're continuing our little ghost run. And, and we put her in the kitchen. She's not making sandwiches, no, she's doing something better than that. She's gonna wait for someone to blow up in the face with her shotgun. And the little fella's just waiting there. Now the unthinkable happens. The little fella discovers the enemy's trump card, a big nasty brute. And he, he gives him a little grazing with his laser pistol. And, and little did we know, the big fella takes a shot and he missed the little fella. So we make the girl wait in the kitchen and the little fella is running for his life. He also spots a second soldier. So we now know what two out of three are left. We know what they are. We know where they are. All thanks to this little fella being in that corner. But unfortunately that's the end of his usefulness. He did a great job of just taking down by that big motherfucker. So now this stage, me and my brother are comp contemplating what to do. He said to scout, but I decided to camp like a little wanker. And now we're starting to move out. And nobody's home. And something bad happens. The guy we saw earlier moves, moves past and gets shot at. She misses, revealing her position. We're in a bad spot now. The other guy hopped onto the roof. So now under pressure, we decide that we need to move away from here. And try and find the big guy and take him out. That's why we got a high chance of winning. 
So we're moving in invisibility, and I can't see us in the oh, we found him. There he is. Now we wanted him to move closer, and he did. He's now in range. Now at this stage, I was contemplating taking control of his unit with mind control. But I decided to listen to my brother who told me, Balls out, go up there and pump that guy in the face. And that's exactly what I did. And it turned out pretty well. Oh yes, hello, how you going mate? Got a nice little shotgun here. Would you like to have a look? Oh yeah, you having a look? Alright. Now just stay there for a second. Oh dear. Oh dear. Now we're feeling pretty good now. It's one versus two. And his trump card is now dead. And all he's got is a scrawny bastard and one unknown unit. And that little scrawny bastard takes a shot, but he misses. So at this stage of the game, we're definitely in the winning position. And he knows it too, he reveals his last unit. So it's just a little flag drawn. He's pretty much got the way they think. They're shifting take a shot and miss. Takes his shots. I decided not to take the bait because the other guy can actually kill us. We can. So I ran in looking for him, but to no avail. At this stage, I don't know what the opponent's thinking. He's just like, all right, I'll take a shot. But after this, he gives up. I don't know why. But I figured he couldn't take him. There it is. Yeah, yeah. I figured he couldn't take her on. And yeah, there's a little achievement. That was definitely my first match, and it was a win. So oh, thanks for watching. And I found that pretty epic, this uh, Rambo soldier. And I've got a couple more um, attempts at using her. And I tried it against some different players. And it turned out pretty well. I'll put those up. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.